NFPA 285 is the standard test method that we use to evaluate the fire performance of combustible materials that are used in building construction in exterior walls. So the big key is NFPA 285 is an assembly test. It is not a component test. So when you are conducting an NFPA 285 test, we're looking at how do all of the materials that are being tested. We also, another big key is we want to try and incorporate worst case conditions to allow us to be able to extrapolate the results within certain bounds to give us the most flexibility for real world use. So when a manufacturer is evaluating their, their product or system in an exterior wall assembly to NFPA 285, they want to ensure that they are testing the worst case scenario. So in that worst case scenario, they're either reaching out to us as fire protection engineers and consultants in this arena to develop that worst case scenario. So the tested assembly will be worst case in terms of combustibility, fuel loading, various dimensions and design components to allow for extrapolation of data later on to give them more flexibility when the design team comes in and say, hey, I wanna build this, this, and this. Are we covered in your tested assembly and engineering evaluations? So that, that base tested assembly that forms the technical justification for an evaluation needs to be robust enough to cover various scenarios.